Hello friends in this video I will show you how to show JSON data and query data table. For this I have using data table a table plugin for jQuery. For using this data tables, first you can go to this data table.net sites. On this site you can get some introduction about his jQuery plugin. You can see that data tables is a plugin for jQuery JavaScript library. It is a highly flexible tool, based upon the foundations of progressive enhancement, and will add advanced interaction controls to any HTML table. There is some extra features like a pagination, instant search and multi-column ordering, it also supports almost any data source like DOM, JavaScript, AJAX and server-side processing. It is easily themeable with data tables, jQuery user interface, Bootstrap. You can easily use this plugin. For using this plugin you can use CDN links of its CSS and JavaScript file. For CSS you can use this CDN link and for JavaScript you can use this CDN link and simply copy. This is my simple code page. On this page I have using JavaScript library jQuery, I have also used Bootstrap CSS library and lastly this is CDN link of CSS and JavaScript data tables plugin on which I will show JSON data into this data table. Friends this is my simple JSON file and on this file first I have create JSON array with named data and in this array I have enter some employee data with column name like game, gender and designation data and I will show this data into jQuery data table. So our JSON file ready with employee database. Now friends I have moved to coding page. On this page I have already put CDN link of data table jQuery plugin for table. First I have create one HTML table with the data table and class with name table table bordered which is class of bootstrap CSS library and close table close. In this table first I have write open and close table head tag and close table head tag and between this tag I have write open and close table row tag and between this tag I have write three table heading tag with first head name is name, second head name is gender and third is heading name is designation. Now friends I have moved to query coding part. For this first I have write open and close script tag and between this script tag I have write dollar document dot ready method with one anonymous function. In function I will use data table method of data tables query table plugin. For this first I have write HTML selector. So I have write dollar data table which is it of HTML table which I have defined above with data table method. This is the main JavaScript code which parse JSON data and data tables. In this method first I have write AJAX option of data table method, which load data for the table content from an AJAX source. Here I have write JSON file name which is employee data dot JSON. This I have already created with some data and store in my working folder. Here I have also used one more option of data table which is columns. This will set column specific initialization properties. In this columns we can define the name of column which is already present in our JSON file. I want to show column from JSON file which is name, gender and designation. For this I have write data with double colon column name name, again I have write data with double colon with column name gender and lastly also I have write data with double colon column name designation. This all column is already present in JSON file and here data is the name of JSON array which I have write in JSON file employee data dot JSON. Now I have saved this code and checked the output in browser.
friends you can see that all employee data are present in on this web page in web formatted table with many features without writing any code. Here friends there is one features like how many data you want to show on web page table. Suppose you want to show 25 data show on table so you simply select 25 and 25 data display in table without any page refresh. There one another features is searching of table data. For this you enter your query here and you get the result of that query data in a moment with any page refresh. Here is also one features like column wise data arrange in ascending order and in descending order. For this you can simply click on this arrow button and can get data in ascending order or in descending order. You can apply this functionality in all column. By using data table plugin you can get the how many number of data in JSON file. Here you can see that there is 31 entries that means there is 31 data are available in our JSON file. And lastly there is one pagination features also in this plugin, you can get the pagination without writing any code and pagination come with format you can see here. So friends this is the some features of this data tables plugin there is also more features available in this plugin, you can use and try it. So this is my video tutorial on how to show JSON data in query data tables. If you like this video please share this video with your friends or share on social media. So friends thank you for watching this video. If you have any query regarding this video you can comment on this video I will reply on your comment. Friends you want to get more update of my video, so, friends you can subscribe my YouTube channel. Friends you can also like my Facebook page also or you can also follow Webslisten on Twitter.